Hi, I'm Scott Sack, and today I want to share a few things with you uh, that are very closely related to TrackMan. I want to share some new distinctions and some new language. What I'm going to talk to you on now is swing direction. Swing direction is a brand new term, and if you weren't using TrackMan, you wouldn't hear the term because it's very closely related to the teaching with TrackMan. Swing direction is nothing more than this. I've got a hula hoop that now is running what I would call square or parallel left to my target. Swing direction on TrackMan is measured from what the golf club is doing from waist high coming into impact. Now, if I were to take my hula hoop and aim it to the right, now that golf club would be moving a little bit more what we call in to out. Now, if you look at some of my other tips, what you're gonna see, anything regardless, whether it's the club or the path, if it's moving right through impact, that's gonna give you positive numbers. And conversely, anything moving left as far as club path or club face will give you negative numbers. So back to, as I go to the top, if I were working on getting a positive swing direction, once again, moving to the right, I would feel that club dropping a little bit more from the inside. And then conversely, if I wanted to get a swing direction from a negative standpoint, which would produce a different ball flight, I'd get that shoulder moving a little out from the top, and that club would be moving left through impact. So once you get a better grasp on swing direction, it's going to be much easier to hit whatever kind of shot you have in mind.